How are you doing today? Welcome to Life with Belsif. I'm your host, Belsif. Well, I just got out of the pool. I had a little swim. This is episode two of the Stand Up Scooter Project. I did a lot of fabricating today. I didn't record it because it was just a lot of banging, welding, bending, cutting, all that kind of stuff. So I'm just gonna do an update video on how I'm doing on it. That's what I think would be best. When I get into the more fun things, I'll start to record again. Welding and fabricating, my welds are dickered too. I'm half blind and I can't even see where I'm going anymore. So half the time my welds aren't even that great, but I'm gonna spin the camera around here and show you what I've done so far and you can let me know in the comments below what you think. And I did listen to you all and I took, I think, eight inches out of the frame I did. So you're gonna see it's a lot shorter. It looks more manageable. Don't worry, the handlebars aren't the way they are. I just put it like that so I can feel how the chain, whatever. I'm gonna turn around the camera and you'll see yourself. So if you look at the front here, I uh, put in the gussif to make it more sturdy. So it turned out pretty good. I put a piece of pipe. It's a thick wall piece of pipe and she's uh, she's mint. That will help hold the front. I'm gonna put a couple there too, but I haven't got around to that yet because I gotta do the plate first for where you stand. But the back is coming along pretty good. I got the uh, reinforcement gussips in the front, which is all welded up in there, nice and tight and sturdy. I gotta put in more stuff because I gotta mount the gas tank in too, so. That's pretty strong, standing and jumped on it and it's pretty friggin' decent. But I got the motor mocked up, as you can see, which is pretty awesome. So I had to bring it up quite a ways. I know people say keep it low. I couldn't keep it low with this frame because I'd have to do too much modifications to the frame for the chain to go through. I already have one modification there that I haven't finished yet that I gotta weld back together, but I had to bend the frame over. We're gonna put a little bracket in there that goes up to the exhaust to help hold the exhaust so it doesn't shake. So that I'll be able to weld back together in no time. And then I can put a seat post up here so I can put a seat on it and then I'll mount the gas tank offset from the muffler here somewhere, right about here, under the seat. What do you think? Leave a comment down below. But it's gonna look pretty friggin' decent. Look at that exhaust pipe, that's friggin' awesome. Friggin' right, it's awesome. Don't know what I'm gonna do there. I might put a fender on the back to make it look a little cooler. I'm gonna see how it goes first with all this extra weight, make sure it still runs before I add more weight. I brought the lower frame back through, under, and then around this loop to help hold extra weight too. So there's all sorts of welds here and all sorts of brackets and angles and ding-dongs and whatnots. It's pretty solid, here I'll show you. So there it is there, and there's my weight on her. And she doesn't even friggin' move, Jim. The tires go flat, that's about it. That's gonna be awesome. Hey, wait a minute, let me set you back so you can see that. See, pretty awesome. Careful. Well, yeah, there you go. So a lot more of the work we got is running cables, making reinforcement mounts for the engine so it doesn't shake shimmy around, make a couple extra brackets there, finish up some parts that don't look right, maybe make some little doodads and whatnots for it. It's come along pretty good. I think we should be done this in probably a couple days. Well, not a couple days, because I haven't got a couple days, but I'll work on a little bit tomorrow again for you, and this and that and the other thing. So here's a little update on episode two of the stand-up rocket bike scooter. Let me know in the comments below what you freaking think. If anybody's wondering, I'm pretty tired today. That's why I'm not full of energy. But I did do a little fly yesterday with the drone, so I'll put it in at the end of this video, and you can check that out, listen to some music. I'll put in some beat step for you. <laughs> e? Why wouldn't I? A little bit of beat step for you. You can listen to that and tell me what you think. But hopefully everybody's having a good day like I am, not doing anything I ain't doing. And until next time, you know what to do for now.